Oh, playoff basketball and the intensity there and the dramatics and having the ball in your hands with a game on the line. And Pat Riley once told me in basketball, he says, there's winning and there's misery. He says, you never feel so alive in that moment. Mm. Ball goes through the net, clock goes to zeros, mm. and uh, the Blazers win. It's just amazing stuff. Well, right. listen, yeah. amazing. Uh, uh, listen, first of all, I'm going to take my hand off to Russell Westbrook and Paul George. These boys competed. And they needed all 50. He got them. <laughs> he got them. Huh? <laughs> yes, he did. You saw a couple they of there. Out trying to put this thing on ice. Or less the same. <laughs> <laughs> he had less. He had 19 in the first quarter. Mm. Wow. And he had 34 in the first half. He had a complete game, too. Inside, outside, penetrate, long and, range. And with McCollum saddled with foul trouble early, his running mate, that guy, man, just he took those control. Those are tough shots right there. I don't hear no pull, Chucks. No, 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 no. That's only reserved for Clay. Okay, my bad. Hey, look, I'm going to call him Clay. I'm going to call him Clay. I'm going to tell you this. You must stop putting him in that category. Okay. Three point shooter. That one won't go, but there's so. Big Ennis Canter, yeah. 60 to 57. It was 61 to 60 at the half. Portland. Look at this, man. No way. That's the same shot. Yeah. Ooh. Same shot. Oh. Well, you, but, but, well, you know, motor. but you got to take your hat off to OKC, man. They really competed. Yeah, they got to be a little smarter than sure. Yeah, I, I would. I would. No, agree. they got to be a lot smarter, not a little smarter. Yeah, I would. A lot smarter. Between turnovers and silly fouls, that's what cost them. Blazers on the run here, and Al Farouk Aminu with the finish, 79-75. Oh, you know what? And let me tell you something. You thought at this point oh. this game was over when they went up 8-9 points. Yeah, 14-2 run. That was their biggest lead. Yeah. But Russ was oh, doing Russ. his thing. Oh, get off me, little fella. 15-2 yeah. thunder run. What an answer. Okay, Russie. Westbrook again. Dennis Schroeder hit a couple of big buckets. This, two. this one, everybody thought it back, man, maybe it might be over. But, 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 you know, I think one more, because Russ is this pass yeah. right here. Like, maybe it's well. over. Yeah, Jeremy I mean, Grant will finish here. This was a 30 to 6 Thunder run. Here's Schroeder again Schroeder. stepping back. You, you, you got 105 to 90 you got with 740 to go. You got to win that game. You got to win that game. You got to win that game. And you got to get the ball out of his hand. Some type of way the ball could not be in his hands. As, uh, Westbrook with the answer right away, and then Paul George, who had 36. Oh, what a move. You're up eight with four minutes to go. Come on, man. CJ McCollum. This is a big floater here, too. Off the glass. And then, and this then another one. Yeah. 21 to 6 Portland run. What's the answer for OKC in a tie game? It's uh, Paul George. Yep. Mm -hmm. Now you got to play some defense. No, nah, this guy, oh, this, you can't give up a layup. No, yeah, any, right. any, it's really, yeah, you, you can't give up right, a layup. Right, yeah, give him a layup. Yeah, no no shot blockers. Lou, who's a shot blocker? Oh, this is game time. Uh, game 37 time. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. This ain't day, game time. This game from game time. <laughs> from but there is no Evan shot blocker. That's just a hell of a shot right there. You just shake a guy's hand if you make that shot. Ooh. Shake his hand. Bye-bye. Oh, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Yeah, bye bye. Man, I don't, I don't bye care bye how many bye. times you watch it, you still can't believe it. Mm -hmm. 118 to 150. Fitty piece. Fitty piece. Man. Portland Trailblazers over the Oklahoma close City out. Thunder. Ten for eight. They close it out. Uh, tenth career playoff triple double for Westbrook and 36 for George in a losing effort. Uh, the 34 in the first half for Lillard, 16 in the second half. Oh, well, a lot of people are going to blame it's, Russell, but man. That's right. I, I know Shaq it got it right. right. Still Still got 50. Yeah, a lot yeah, of I people are going to blame Russ. Shaq, Shaq had said three things could possibly happen after that big first half. He could get more, he could get less, or he could get the same. Well, you know, and I just want to say this. You know, a lot of people criticize man. Russell Westbrook. And let me just say this he can play on my team anytime. Uh, he's not perfect. Uh, I so what, what would you say that today that he did incorrectly? I'm not sure if I saw anything today. I thought that he was not aggressive in the beginning. Mm -hmm. And I thought they, uh, they could have, number one, that was, they didn't use the shot clock down the stretch. And there was three fouls they committed. Did they have, or him? He committed two of them. Okay. Because. Yeah, I mean, down the stretch, I was making notes too. 2-10 to play. George misses. 
two free throws. That then was the, big. Then an offensive foul after that to turn it over. And then another bigger. turnover yeah. with about a minute and 20 yeah. seconds to go. And it, um, yeah, the, the me mental mistake. But you know what? They gave all they had, man, and you got to respect that. Here's uh, Billy Donovan after the loss. I thought, um, I thought late in the game, I'm anxious to see some of them. Um, you know, I thought Russell's charge was, was, was a big play in the game. Uh, I thought Ferguson's over the back foul. That was another big play. We had another couple fouls. We put him to the free throw line. Um, you know, I don't know if those calls were, were accurate or not. Well, I'm, see, I'm not, I don't have any opinion on it. They, just, they were tough calls that could have changed momentum a little bit. I know Paul had a couple free throws we could have knocked down. So we kind of struggled to put, just keep continue to put some points on the board. We gave them some free throws. Harkless shot it well from the free throw line. And then obviously Lillard had uh, a, a great game from, from start to finish. So. You know, our guys battled and competed and, um, you know, just weren't able to close the game out. Billy, with the way you all defended with Jeremy kind of in the pick and rolls, Adams on, on Harkless, they didn't get rolls to the rim and, and catch and shoots, kind of betting that Lillard wasn't going to be able to shoot the way that he did. Was that sort of the, the strategy that, that you tried to go to? And do you feel like it had a chance to work? Uh, I'm, I'm not sure I understood what mean in terms of what part. I guess, did you feel like Lillard might run out of gas having to go one, oh, one the um, entire game? You know, obviously he played the whole first half. Um, I probably would have done the same thing with Paul, you know, had he not picked up fouls. Um, you know, we, I thought we gave a really, really good effort, but he was really, um, he made some tough shots. I mean, you got to give him credit. I mean, I think at the night he had, uh, and the shots that he made, um, epitomized the last shot of the game. Those are kind of some of the shots he made throughout the first half. Um, I thought some of them were really well defended. I thought we worked hard. We tried to trap him some. Uh, sometimes he was able to kind of get through it and get downhill. I thought we came over and pulled across and help. Um, you know, I know McCollum never really got into the flow of the game uh, with the foul trouble, but I thought, you know, that last five minutes, he kind of stepped up and made some big shots for them as well. You know, in critical times like elbow, mid-range, pull-up jumpers off the dribble, well guarded. Um, and, um, you know, that obviously uh, kind of got them on their run. For the Thunder, 12 straight losses on the road in the postseason. The last road game that's they won in the post was game impossible. one. Game one at Golden State in the Western Conference Finals in 16. That's they, won, they won that game and they've lost the next oh. 12 on the road. No, Jack, that, I'm just saying, in the like, postseason. To None as painful as this one. For, for that team. Yeah, for that team. But to lose 12 straight games, uh, that's. That, that, they have too much talent. They got too much talent. Yeah, and, that, and, 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 and talent. 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 No, no, and no, no. No, they, no. No. And experience. Serious, Shaq, they got, you, come they got on, 12 straight games. You can't lose 12 straight games. Not with Russell Westbrook and, you know. Paul George, and, Stephen and Adams. The guys that have, well, 12 would be more than this this year, but the guys that have gone through that, that system, they are, that is a remarkable stat. They have 4-13 and 13 since Durant left. Well, a lot of, uh, you're not, no, but, we, but I'm saying they still got enough not have, to lose 12 straight games. I'd rather have two talented players and nine, 10, 11 smart guys. That's all I'm saying. How about Billy Donovan? Uh, how are you feeling if you are Billy Donovan oh, right sick. now? And, and sick. Uh, well, obviously sick about the game. Looking at the future of the Oklahoma City Thunder with Billy Donovan. Well, he's not going anywhere, I don't think. Uh, they, they need to develop an identity. I think it's time to move Russ to the two. Because I think he's too aggressive offensively. You play Schroeder and, and Westbrook together all the time? Yes. Because I think he's so good and aggressive. He's one of those guys who can get his shot all the time. It goes back to what we were saying the other day. When you have an advantage, sometimes you got to take a step back. When I played with certain guys, I could get a shot every time. But I said to myself, like Shaq could get a shot every time. But sometimes he had to get a shot for Derek Fisher. Devin George, Rick Fox, guys who can't get their own shot. So I think that Russell has to take a step back. And I said this today on PTI. He's always driving at 100 miles an hour. He should drive at 55, sometimes raise to 70. You don't drive your car at 100 all the time. And that's, that's the only weakness I see. He's always going 100% speed all the time. I, I, would, I would say that, you know, I understand your point, but I don't know if that is the solution. Meaning, when the game is on the line, 
I wouldn't want to have. I would rather have Russell Westbrook with the basketball up top than than shooter. It's just I would rather have that because I know that one, they're not going to trap him. Two, he's physical enough to take the contact. Three, he will get us something. But you just have to be have a strong enough personality to make him do something, other than sometimes he might not see. And then, see you have to be his, go ahead, his, his second pair, pair of eyes for him. Maybe the same way that Phil was for Kobe to be his second pair of eyes, and he has to trust that. You know, coaches get the blame for a lot, but it's never on the coaches. It's always on the players. Sometimes you have to learn not to be predictable. Everybody know Russ and Paul is going to get the ball at the end, but that's when you use your other guys. Yeah. Like Paul, you got three guys waiting for you. Kick it to Schroeder. He just hit two threes. Russ, control the clock. Where I thought they did that tonight, control. though, Shaq. Nah, but, but, I mean, Dame, Dame didn't do it, and he won the game. He know, won the, the game. game. He, he's like, no, nah, you know what? And then all of a sudden, CJ hit two shots. He hit the two oh, big ones, and that was it. Yeah, Those were the two guys with it. CJ hit a shot. But so did, they, so they did George. They don't sprinkle it out. They, they give the ball to, to oh, Russ Westbrook and, George. and Westbrook, That's and it. everybody stands yeah, around. And when, you're, and when you're up 15... With yep. seven, yeah, that, nah, seven nah, change that's, to that's, go. That's gotta hard. Gotta that's hard. Like that. Like that. You got to win that game. Yeah. You got to win that's that game. That's hard to swallow. Uh, and so right. they advanced to meet the winner of San Antonio and Denver. 